can say I'm a Christian and it is no real that I'm a Christian. Praise the Lord, somebody. Now when the life of God comes into you, there are manifestations. There are You remember my last message I preached here? I told you my life. Do you remember the message? Yes. How that old man appeared to me in the dream. And he said, my son, come. Do you remember? When I woke up, I cried. I said, what is my problem? And the Lord opened my eyes, and since then, it is taken care of. 1982, taking care of the gospel. The nine. Now, when you are really of God, I want to say to somebody in this house, you can't fail in this life. But you must first be the servant. If you are not a servant of God, you have no inheritance in this house. Who is a servant, not a pastor? We all are servants of God. Isaiah 54 says in verse 17, this is the heritage of God. the servants of the Lord, and their righteousness is of me, says the Lord. Everybody is come to serve. Amen. Amen. Now when we become who God has ordained us to be, one thing happens, man of God. John the Baptist said, I must decrease and he must increase. He must increase. I must become nothing so that the men of God will be exalted. Hallelujah. Serious pastors meeting every Tuesday. We are the pastors from every branch. We gather together. And there was a time when what we never expected the church started happening. Gossip and backbiting in a very bad way. And I sat the leaders down. I told them, I said, If Brother May come to you to tell you something, ask him. The person you are saying who said this thing, can we ask him? Three of us should sit down and talk. Three of us should do what? And he said, no, I just want you to be careful. He said, sorry, you did not tell me any. You didn't tell me. It ends it. But you want me to come here. Then I believe that he says something. Let's talk. Amen. As a pastor, I don't live by them. Say, you don't tell me stories. If you're not ready to point at the person, forget it. And we came to a point where we now agreed. I told them, I said, this is the policy. Secretary, write it down. And the secretary told the people. I said, if mama is caught in gossip, she must be suspended. She must be Hello? Because mama is expected to show that sample. So if she's caught in gossip, in gossip, I read the people and they fully convince us. The one has said it, bring her to the higher court, the court of elders. And they will ask her, why did you say, and, 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 and this person? <laughs> and they're looking at me, why? The Bible says, rulers are not a terror to good works. We carry the sword not in vain. Very simple as you see, but terror when it comes to. We don't, we don't joke about spiritual things because we know where the devil is coming from and we must keep him where he belongs. Yes. Peter didn't like Jesus, he didn't like Mr. Perry, look at Peter and he told him, get him behind me, Satan. He saw the devil in Peter and he must be rebuked and cast out. Anybody who gave himself to the devil must be handled as a child of the devil. Are you hearing me? If 
if a sister come to me and say, my God, I'm sorry, I fornicate it. And he prayers. I don't know how I'm feeling. Then I go to the bedroom and say, Mama, can you imagine? That girl fornicated yesterday. Hmm, she fornicates. I am not a pastor. You 
Praise the Lord. Because the church remains, chapter 20 of the book of Acts, verse 28. The church of God, which Jesus bought with his own blood. Nobody died for you. Nobody did what? Nobody died for me and nobody died for you. I didn't die for anybody. When the words came to us and I discovered that the pastor wanted to take my hand because I didn't understand, I turned to Jesus and I told him, I said, Jesus, now you die with me and not die for anybody. Because <laughs> so I didn't die for anybody, now you die. So anything you want to do it to what you can do. For me, I have a life to live. <laughs> so we better, we better sit down and, 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 and analyze things properly. Whether you want me to do this work or not, because I didn't die for anybody. Praise the Lord. Nobody died for me. And I didn't die for anybody. It is only Jesus that died for us. Yes. Only He carried the cross on our behalf. Yes. Amen. Yes. Praise the Lord. Yes. And now that I discover that somebody owns the church, not a human being, I must put in my best. Amen. To make it what it's supposed to be. Amen. Yes. The man stood before the church and he told the congregation, all of you can go to hell, this is my church. He didn't take six months, he died. You can't kill God's church. Oh, this is God's church. I told my people, even though it is God's church, are you here? But there is somebody God has committed into his trust. Take charge, you are a caretaker. On my behalf. Amen. Yes. And I must stand as a caretaker to do the right thing. Amen. To punish those who are supposed to be punished and bless those who are supposed to be blessed. It's a thing that are in the flesh, what? Cannot be God. Because their heart is in enmity with God. Enmity. The things that are contrary, that's the things they will do in the church. They are always lead them to do things that will not give God the glory. And if you watch such people and you buy their ways, you are finished. Hello? Am I communicating? You watch such people and you say, hey, I saw somebody who prayed with Dickens and Dickens will just tell you that time. Tomorrow let her come and stand before me and I will give up to you. You don't buy evil. You don't see evil communication to us. When you see an evil character run away from her, run away from him. Because you want to live a blessed life. Amen. Praise the Lord, somebody. All of us want to be blessed. And ever remain blessed. Shout hallelujah, somebody. Rise up, let's be blessed. Let's be blessed. Let's be blessed. Hallelujah to you. Shout hallelujah. Let us pray. I want to release yourself before the most high. You said to me, Papa, you have spoken to me. I heard you. And I want to be blessed and live the blessed life. Shall we pray? Can I let you open your mouth? I want to get the best out of this life. There is a light that leads to destruction, but I don't want to be part of it again. I have been delivered out of this destruction. This path that leads to destruction, I don't want it to be my portion anymore. I want to prove a point in the name of the Lord that I can get the best. Heavenly Father, have mercy on me. Have mercy on me. Let the blood speak for me. Mercy on me. I don't want to be a destroyer, I want to be a builder. I want to help your own. I want to make a difference. I want to live a life that tomorrow when you look back, you say, She lived for me, so I will live for her. He lived for me, so I will live for him. He stood for me, he fought for me, and I will fight for him. Have mercy on me. Heavenly Father, have mercy on me. Open your mouth up to God. You are ordained to be an instrument unto God. The Bible said in the great house there are vessels unto dishonor, 
and there are faces of tomorrow. Which one do you choose to be? That God will choose you on tomorrow. Choose you unto goodness and mercy. Choose you unto blessings. That there will be no room for the devil to take the glory. As God is for it, I have come to serve you. I have come to do your will. I have come to obey you. I have come that you will be glorified in my life. I have come that everything about me, the devil will be to shame. Let me straighten my path. Help me to live the right life, the blessed life, to turn away from ungodliness, to turn away from the way of sinners, to turn away from the way of this comfort, the mockers, and live a life that will glorify you. I come that you will be glorified in my life. Submit yourself to him. Let Jesus be exalted. In Jesus' name, yes. lift your hands before him. Mighty God, somebody say after me, Heavenly Father. Yes. Can I hear you? Yes. The Father of the Lord Jesus Christ. Yes. My God yes. and my Master, yes. my owner yes. and my all in all. Today, before your court, I come to declare Jesus is not only my Savior, He is my Lord. Lord Jesus, I submit my heart to you. Help me to live for you. I don't want to be condemned. I don't want to be destroyed. Let your blood speak for me. The blood of Jesus, let the blood that was shed for me, shed for my iniquity, to cleanse me and to make me a child of God. Let the blood, the blood of Jesus, speak for me. Have mercy and receive me as your daughter, as your son, that I will live for you and do your will and obey you. Be your servant all the days of my life. And you will bless me and manifest your glory in my life. This I desire in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, lift your people unto your throne. Mighty God. This gospel is not preached as a story. 